day and welcome now today's video is going to be a very easy peasy two ingredient insect spray um i have received this from a good friend of mine jackie uh, she make this and they've been using this for uh, quite a long time and she gifted me a little bottle and i thought okay it's not mosquito season yet um, i'm going to try it out then i will share it with you guys um, mosquito season just moved in it started raining two days ago um, we've had lovely rain for two days it's even still raining on and off at the moment and i must say the mosquitoes somewhere along the line popped all out um, interesting thing i did some research on mosquitoes and um, there are a lot of essential oils that is actually much more effective than citronella oil now citronella oil is the one that we all know i do not really care for the smell i'm not crazy about it but it's not that bad um i prefer citronella oil smell over being bitten by mosquitoes but um the the research the interesting part of the research is that um different mosquitoes are reacting differently to different decision is essential oils so what will work for one breed of mosquito is not going to work for another one so i am busy working at a formulation with various different kinds of essential oils that i'm going to put together um, and test it out and so on and give or take i don't think i'm going to make it within this season to market it but it might just hit the market in time for the next mosquito season because i like to over test and keep on fiddling with stuff but okay let's just jump right into this let me show you how easily you can make a mosquito deterrent um, spray that is cheap and effective and it does really work quite well and yeah only two ingredients how much maybe you can get okay the only two ingredients you're going to need is going to be some vodka um, this one that i've got here is a 43 percent alcohol so um, I'm not sure what is available where you are and then whole gloves gloves or gloves um, I think it's gloves uh, depending on where you are in the world so the lovely clove seeds that we like to use in our cooking and so on as well that is all that you're going to need so then you're going to need not ingredients a jar we're going to take a jar what you're going to do is you are going to fold the jar to a point okay let's line it up to there i don't think the men is going to think this is a cheap way to make a, a mosquito repellent although you know what this is about 120 rand where i live mosquito repellent small little one already basically at the same price and then it's not really that effective either so there we go okay so this is about a cup full of vodka and then you are going to use one table okay this tablespoon is too big and about a tablespoon 15 milliliter of cloves that you are just going to add to it You're going to close it up and you're going to shake it, shake it and it will start to absorb and then you're going to put it down somewhere where it is nice and dark and warm and then after a while you're going to end up with a very dark liquid like this um, so this one has been standing about for three months now no it's not three months it's about a month and a half um jackie believes that you need to let this go stand for three months for it to reach the maximum potency um i have been made the first batch and i think i've used it within a week or so but i did put it in a water bath to speed things up a little bit and it does work quite well um this has been standing for quite some time um as i said it's a month and a half now so for five six weeks here yeah, six to eight weeks around about there i'm not sure but it's definitely not three months yet but it is potent you can smell it smells like um you got too fake <laughs> because that is what we usually use gloves for okay so if it stood for a while then you're gonna need a little container with a spout 
you need a strainer am i in camera yeah i need to move everything over there okay so, oops it is difficult to check over one shoulder and try to work in a different direction then you're just going to strain it okay those 200 milliliters and you are going to decant it in a little spray bottle if you want to make this even more potent apparently vanilla um, also deters insects so you can maybe add a little bit of vanilla in here as well and vanilla does smell nice i haven't tried that before but can't do any harm there and then you need to label your stuff because if it's anything like in my house there are a gazillion little bottles with unidentified liquids and stuff in there and then after a while you don't really know what's in there you think you're going to remember but then you don't or at least i don't so let's just stick our little mosquito sticky on there and then you have your first bottle of mosquito deterrent two ingredients vodka and cloves as easy as that so there you're gonna go let me just show you if you strain this completely the cloves kind of swell up and it loses its color it's this very dull um, little buds here that's left over so there is enough for another two bottles there so i can i can okay this is a 300 i need jar it's 300 and something milliliters so if i make that i can make three of these little bottles it's on the four up that one as well from 300 milliliters of vodka okay. okay as i say i don't think this is something that you will market um, and sell but it is a very nice diy uh, project to do at home easy and quick okay and there is our second little bottle and now the sticker is skew as you can get so this is gonna bug me like the mosquitoes but i'll fix it later on okay so there we go that is our two ingredient mosquito deterrent and if you want to do a three ingredient and put a little bit of vanilla essence in there or vanilla extract then you are welcome to do that as well so that is it i will see you guys in the next video again Keep well, keep safe, and don't let the bed bugs bite and the mosquitoes and all of those other things. Okay, bye.